There are a ton of real estate website providers out there, each with dozens of templates and customization options. I mean, how do you know if your new website has what it takes to rank on Google, to capture leads, to be the home base of your entire operation? Well, in this video, we'll reveal the seven critical components that your real estate website needs in order to be successful. Let's get to it. My name is Chris Linsell. I'm the senior real estate writer, coach, and resident real estate technologist at TheClose.com, and I'm excited to share my must-haves for any real estate agent website. Before we get started, though, I want to thank the sponsor of this video, Playster. Playster is a website and marketing platform designed specifically for real estate professionals. They offer customizable, high-performing, IDX-ready websites that act as the hub of your marketing and branding wheel, plus personalized professional services for agents, teams, and brokers, all to take their businesses to the next level. Playster is invested in the success of your new website, which is why they're offering a fantastic ebook called The Ultimate Guide to Building a Real Estate Website. This book is free. You can get a copy by clicking the link below. I definitely suggest you check it out. Okay, who's ready to start building a successful real estate website? These are the seven things that I believe you absolutely have to have. Number one is IDX search capability. This feature allows users to search for properties available for sale, to create customized alerts for properties that fit their needs and their budget, and generally turns your website into a portal that your prospects and leads and clients can all use to interact with the market at large. Without IDX, your website is basically just a multi-page business card. If you want your site to be interactive, Make sure you've got IDX search. The second thing every website needs is customizable lead capturing landing pages. Landing pages, if you're not familiar, are single focused web pages that act kind of like, um, like a front door to your website for anyone coming in, but especially those coming by the way of an advertisement. These landing pages are critical in maintaining conversion rates and making sure that you're getting your money's worth on any paid lead generation that you're doing to send traffic to your site. Without landing page options, your website traffic becomes largely anonymous and anonymous traffic is really difficult to convert to clients. Component number three of a successful real estate website is the ability to create neighborhood guides. Guys, real estate isn't just local, it's hyper-local. Buyers and sellers care about what's happening on the streets and in the neighborhoods where they are looking to buy and sell. Your website needs to deliver on these needs. Sections like neighborhood guides allow you to create content specifically about the most popular areas in the markets that you serve. You're signaling to your clients that you're not only an expert in real estate, but you're a specific expert in the places that matter most to them. This sort of differentiation is often the deciding factor between who gets the client and who doesn't. Neighborhood guides. Component number four on my must have list of real estate website elements is school ratings. Now, I know what you're thinking. You're thinking, Chris, not everyone looking for a home has kids or cares about schools. And you know, that's true. But for those who do have kids and those who do care about schools, this is a huge level up. Plus, this feature is almost always a plugin that requires no work on an agent's part, while at the same time providing a ton of value and upside that may help your buyers feel better about their decisions. My fifth can't live without website feature is the option for robust original blogging. The absolute best way to establish yourself as an expert in a particular area 
is through content marketing. And the best way to content market on the internet is through blogs. Blogs allow you to share your knowledge, to outline your experience, to communicate your expertise. Your website needs an easy to maintain blog. It needs to be accessible for your clients, your prospects, and your leads, and you need to be writing in it regularly. Number six, the sixth feature that every real estate website needs. It seems obvious, but it's amazing how many providers get this wrong. I'm talking about varied contact and lead capture options on literally every page of your site. Guys, if you wanna convert your website traffic into clients, you need to have ways for them to raise their hand and say, yes, I'm ready. Finally, my seventh must have website element is a front and center display of your most satisfied clients in the form of reviews and testimonials. According to the National Association of Realtors, more than 75% of buyer and seller clients consider reviews as a factor when deciding whether or not to work with an agent. A hearty, customizable review section with the option to choose how things are displayed is a great way to verify to your prospects that, yeah, you can in fact deliver on the promises you made. And in fact, here's some proof. That's it. Not complicated. You can do it. Seven must-have components for a top real estate website. Thanks everyone for watching. Good luck with your real estate websites. We'll see you next time.